No publication, as far as I know, has received permission for coverage on the ground. Uh, we have been in contact with the U.S. Army Special Operations Command for the last months, but the only information that we've received has been in pre-prepared press releases. Uh, no media will be allowed to witness what actually happens during Jade Helm. A lot of the coverage that we're going to do will be through the civilian groups that have assembled volunteers to do their own monitoring. Um, they'll be there on the ground trying to figure out what's going on. Um, because uh, as far as we know, it is simply a training exercise. There's not that much that we're going to be interested in covering. And uh, re really the real story for us here is that it's been so radically and aggressively received by so many people in Texas. So that's what we'll be covering. I'm just a reporter here in Houston, so I don't have um, inside sources in the military that could tell me about these kinds of things. Uh, you know, because it is secretive, we don't know what they're doing. I, I have posed questions to the U.S. Army Special Operations Command asking, uh, to what extent is this unprecedented drill a reaction to current um, global events, to geopolitics? Is this in preparation for anything particular? Uh, is this, to what extent does this represent a stylistic pivot for the military in, in looking at other forms of, of special warfare? Uh, none of those questions have been answered, so I personally cannot say uh, to what extent their need for secrecy is warranted. I can tell you that many people here in Texas and a large basis for the reaction that, that you've seen is people believe they have a right to know things that they are not being allowed to know, uh, specifically with what's going to go on in Jade Helm and in private property and public property. There's a very large variety of what people say. Um, on one hand, there are people who believe that that the United States government wants to exert further control of Texas. They think possibly someone will come and take their guns, but this is a pretty fringe element uh, and, and really should not be taken seriously. Uh, more towards the middle, there are people who are just worried and 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 their opponents, political opponents of the federal government, and thus are somewhat even offended that their land, their municipalities, even their state is being used as a training ground uh, for soldiers. And, and so they're projecting their distaste for the federal government onto um, the, the actions of this federal military that's going to be training there. There are other people who welcome it and who don't see any problem with the with the drill so there's big diversity out there <laughs>